Hi guys, it's me Skylar Capri and today I'm coming at you with a swimming related video and these are my five favorite products for swimmers in the summer. I know definitely the heat, the chlorine definitely does take a toll on your skin, your body and all that stuff and I thought I would put together a video for you to show some of my favorite products to deal with summer skincare. Before I get started, my tank top it was shown in my recent haul. That is my huge haul on a budget which I will leave in the cards right now and it is from Old Navy. It's just a black racerback tank top and then my lipstick is the ColourPop, I have it right in front of me, the ColourPop Ultra Matte Lip in the shade Fresh Cut. It's a really pretty kind of pink summery color and they smell so so good. So that's what I'm doing today and I think we should just get right on into it. Before I do have a YouTube Instagram. It is called Skylar Capri in case you're wondering and it would really make me happy if you guys gave this a thumbs up. I know you guys tend to love my swimming videos but I wanted to mix swimming and beauty together today so by giving a thumbs up or leaving a comment telling me your opinion on the video that is awesome. Remember try to keep the comments positive constructive criticism is always welcome but positivity is really encouraged on my channel so let's just get right into it the first thing is actually a shower gel this is the bath and body works almond and vanilla with natural almond oil shower gel um, I believe this is not available anymore, unfortunately, unless you can find it on their website. Most of their past products are on the Bath & Body Works website, but this has natural almond oil in it. I know olive oil or um, certain types of oils, or especially Moroccan oil, in body care is really good and really hydrating. This is a cruelty-free product, and it retails for $12.50. You do get 10 fluid ounces in here. I had to double check. But this smells really good. Um, I'm not sure if you can still get it, but normally you can online. If you can, I will link it in the description box down below alongside all of the, of the other products. But if you can't, I will find the most similar product on the Bath & Body Works website to link for you. So definitely would recommend the shower gel. Again, anything with the um, natural oils in it are definitely going to help hydrate your skin and that chlorine and the sun with sunburn and outdoor pools is definitely going to need more hydration. So this is a definite recommend. Another thing I really recommend is this Jelly Pong Pong Lip Scrub. This is a coffee and coconut one. I'm not the biggest coffee fan myself, but this is nice mixed with coconut. It's really tropical, I believe. This is, yep, it is. This is cruelty free, as was the um, shower gel. But it looks like this. I've used a good amount of it. If you've ever tried a Lush Lip Scrub, they have bigger granules of sugar, but this is more of a paste almost material with salt. Um, this is really good and it's nice and compact. You can take it definitely awesome for your lips when you do a lip scrub and then put a lip balm of your choice on and I would definitely recommend this. Also, you can find lip scrubs as Lush, as I said, which are also cruelty free, but they do have some, I'm not sure if they're cruelty free or not, they do have some drugstore lip scrub options. I believe Wet n Wild just came out with one in their summer collection. Another piece of skincare is the Formula 10.0 X. 10.06 picture perfect day daily moisturizer this is an spf 15 and it does have guava and vitamin c in it i really love this for my sensitive skin it does a great job and it definitely here why am i getting a glitter there you go it's really pretty it has like these yellow words and that kind of says everything about the product which is nice um, you do get 2.54 fluid ounces in here, and you can pick this one up at Ulta. Normally, this skincare brand is buy one, get one half off um, around their sale times, which is awesome because it already is affordable, but you can get it for even cheaper, so which is great. But this gives my skin a nice hydrating feel. It's not super greasy, which I know is gross, and it does have sunscreen in it. I feel like sunscreen builds in to moisturizers are really awesome because then you're already packed with sunscreen however you will probably want to put on a sunscreen before getting in an outdoor pool because the sun is strongest normally from 12 to 3 and that's when typical practices are they're not going to be too early in the morning unless you go to a certain swim club but most practices are going to be in the afternoon because it is summertime um, if you need a sunscreen recommendation for sensitive skin i definitely recommend the Neutrogena Broad SPF 70 sunscreen. I've been using that 
for about five years now. It's my favorite. It never breaks me out. I never get really burning, watery eyes from it. I know that has happened with other sunscreens, but it's really good and it does do a good job of keeping your skin safe from the sun. Also, the Neutrogena Zinc one. Um, zinc has a special property in it where basically sunlight cannot get through it, so you will not get burned. I would do the broad um, SPF 70 all over the face, then I do the zinc just under the eyes because that's where you're wiping your eyes to get the water out. So that's kind of my porte on sunscreen. Another product I've been loving are these Pons Luminous Clean um, Moisture Clean Telets. These are makeup remover wipes. These have cold cream technology and they have kaolin, I think that's how you pronounce it, clay. I picked these up at Ollie's for $2.99, so super great deal. These come with 34 and it is a bonus pack, so it does have 20% more than their other type. These are super affordable. They are really good for sensitive skin. I found that um, with other skincare um, products, for makeup wipes, I'm burning my skin, my eyes are getting all red and itchy, and my skin is getting red and patchy. So I definitely recommend these, and they do a good job of not being like the moisturizer, not being that greasy texture and that residue after the skin. So I would definitely recommend these. I mean, they're $2.99, super cheap, cheaper than most drugstore options for, um, what are these called, makeup wipes. And I would definitely recommend these because these are my all-time favorite and I will continue to purchase. I think they also have an exfoliating version. However, I am not 100% sure, but I think that this is the best version for sensitive skin. And my last product is actually a body scrub that was sent to me. This was sent to me by Aloish Products. They are an awesome, all-natural, organic brand that is cruelty-free. This is their oatmeal scrub. I've actually used it so much, it doesn't even look like that, that the outer kind of covering packaging has come off. But this is their oatmeal scrub. Again, I will have their website linked down below, and I believe I have a coupon code for you. It is not um, in turn with me. I don't get any commission from it but I believe you get 10% off your purchase of 25 or more. So I will leave that code down below along with the link for their website. Um, I do really like this. Again, if I would ever get Center product, I'm gonna do an honest review on it because I want to be with the consumer's best interest and I don't wanna recommend you something that I don't like myself. This is really nice. It does have bigger oatmeal granules, so it's not a salt scrub. I find that salt scrubs sometimes burn my skin, which is not ideal, obviously, in the shower, but this is super nice. I did this last night and then I used this and my skin was super soft. I didn't even have to put on lotion. And yeah, so this was definitely a great combination because this is like a warm vanilla -y scent and then this is an oatmeal scrub with a kind of warm cinnamon scent. So these two paired really nicely together. I believe a substitute for this is the warm vanilla sugar from Bath & Body Works, which is out real, which is out year round. And I think that those two with this, um, combination would be really awesome for sensitive skin in need of some hydration in these summer months. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was kind of a shorter style video and I hope that it was helpful in terms of swimming and beauty and a mix of those two. Those are two of my favorite passions. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please subscribe for more beauty, swim, and lifestyle content and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys!